Hey there, welcome back and thanks for joining me. All my supplies and equipment are down in the description box below and they all have links, so check that out. If you like this video, hit that subscribe button. If you want to see videos when they first come out, hit that notification bell. Now what I want to do is show you, I'm going to use an airbrush, I believe. I might change, you know me. Um, if I don't like how it does, I'll change. This is my master. Most of the time, this is what I use. This is the wrong hair, air hose. Uh, this is my master. And this is the little one. This is the one I use 99.9% of the time. So, um, you can kind of hear it. This does not have a dial. It has a dial, not a numbered dial. It's around 15 to 25. And you can kind of hear it. So, that's the comparison with the noise. This is my big fellow. That's a model TC320. It is in the description. It has a number dial. It has, this is the dial that you do this with. You can put a couple of uh, airbrushes there. You know, kind of lets them sit there like this. Um, but this is how it sounds. Now right now it's at a 40. We'll turn it down to 30. Let's see, you can hear that. Now, this is what it sounds like down the floor. So, it kind of gives you an idea of the two. Price-wise, they're around $30, $35 um, separate from each other. The uh, little black boxed master is in the 50s. The other one is in the 80s, or at least when I bought them. So that's the range difference. If you were going to do one or the other, you can do everything with the big one. But if you're traveling or you just don't want to spend that extra money, I've done everything with the little one. So... You know, it's a, it's a choice. You can take some things into consideration and make your uh, choice on that. But I I like both, and I do travel with my little one. So, there's that information. All right. <clears throat> I'm back and forth. Yeah, I think I'm going to use this. I, I want to do the blowing petals, but I'm the what I'm wanting to do with the head of the flower, I feel it's going to be a little heavy looking bulky looking for the delicate blown flowers so i do think i'm going to use this what i am going to do is use a couple of these colors i might use all three but i've got marine stone wash and denim the marine is really turquoisey compared with these two these two blend really well they they're close and they're the same type of uh, blue the turquoise is I mean, the uh, aquamarine is that. So, it screams a little bit, but th that's kind of the part I like. It, it picks up that color. So, um, other than that, I have no idea what I'm, I'm going to do. Um, I've got a couple things in mind, so let's just, let's just go to it. So, we'll do the denim. I may have to do that. Um, I'm going to put denim down, maybe about right there. We'll let that kind of mix. I don't know if that makes a huge difference, but I've been doing that and it seemed to work out all right. I'm going to tilt this going away and see what it does. Yeah, I just didn't do that. The difference between that and the bulb, the bulb will spread it out and be, but I don't know, do I want little petals? I don't think so. Okay, ditching this. I, you know, I always go back to this. I don't know why I keep trying. See how much prettier that is? 
going to figure out what to do with him. So I may just put something down here. Because I'm going to put another one over this. Um, we'll do some stone wash. Okay, this one's going to like come in screaming at you because it's going to be different, but it's pretty cool. Plus, I'm going to put some back over it. Yeah, the first time I did it, I was like, yikes, have I messed up or what? And until I finished, I went, yep, you've messed up. I've not done this. I'm not sure if I like that, but I'm just doing. Let's see, I like how that does. That's still bright. Well, I just squirted that out. That right there is kind of weird. Wow, that just went really nuts right there. I don't. I didn't like that at all. I'm going to put some through here. What's up? What's that? Okay. I like that shape. <laughs> Just not sure. Uh... But it, I think it's gonna, it's got the potential to look really cool. I want to cover some of that up, but not a lot, and I'm having trouble. I think I need, need to turn my paper. <clears throat> I like this is darker and lighter over here, so I'm going to continue with that. Okay. 
I'm going to drop it right here. I'm going to do another one to cover this beginning uh, of the color. Okay, so I still got some of that color. And you know, I don't know if that looks. Eh, yeah, I want to put just another streak there. So I'm going to do three. One more. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I like that. That bothers me, but I'm still stopping because I know it's just me wanting it even. <clears throat> so, all right. I'm going to do black acrylic. This is a Daler Ronnie. Ronnie. And I have a rigger brush here. Okay. If I do, I don't think I want to do a cone. I just think I want to do something more of this right through there. That one is drove me nuts. And this is just a little pen you dip in ink, or you can use a stylist or the back of the brush, or the bottom of the brush. Okay. <clears throat> All right. I'm going to make piece come down like this is a petal maybe here okay um okay I want to do the center first um I want to get that out of the way so I won't have to reach over things to try to get to it. So I want to get that out of the way. I am going to use a, uh, my airbrush. I've got it on 40. And what I did was take my stylist and I'm going to make, put it down and make a movement. And that's going to force it to follow that. Okay. 
Now something I need to do is get that dry because that was got this on fairly small. And I'm just kind of swirling it and trying to direct it a little bit. Obviously, I can't do a great bit of directing because... When I started out, I am that close, but it's also little drops. If it was bigger, it would act differently. Okay, I think that looks weird. I don't know what to do about the white yet, so I'll just hang on off on that. Uh, I might do the Posca over it and not spray it because I don't mind it picking up some of that. I don't want it to be stark white, um, so it will come off as a little bit of a gray. All right, I may mess it up, but I have more paper. Um... I don't want much through here, but just a little bit. Just a little. Something like that. Outlining, it seems to be a different style unless I go in and really um, make it loose and very disconnected. That is definitely disconnected. So let me try that. Okay, here is my liner. Use that. I'm just going to add something so it's not just as even. Um, I don't, I don't know what else I could do that would, I do too. So just like I did that, why not do that in a flower? Let's see. I'm going to pull off of it because I really...
can see that kind of goes with that. Since there's so many coloring layers in here, I, I think there needs to be some secondary petals, you know, like two rows of them, not just that one long. I think that fills it in really nice. And this is where you let your color say, hey. All right, again, may mess it up, but all right, everything's dry. I really want to see if I can just do a tiny little bit on the ends, not even maybe two places, three places. Keep going this way. Stop it. I want to go this way. There we go. More than I intended, but there. We'll just kind of even some of these. Hmm. Thinking I'd rather not have done it, but on the other hand, yeah, I think that'd been fine without it. Maybe done some extra down here, but there's always another piece of paper, but I do like it. I am having fun with it. Mm-hmm. I am having fun with it. I do want to do some white, so
I'm still bugged because I'm not thrilled with them, although I might be. But right now I'm like, oh, I wish I hadn't done that. Where is this one? There. <clears throat> okay. Uh, after all, it's just paper. Well. Both of those didn't need to be there. I'm holding it midway, trying not to keep too much control over it. I just wondered. <laughs> Could have covered up. But. I'm going to mess it up. All right. Yeah, the. The, this needs more, and I think I'm going to do um, Posca. This is not the big one. This is a medium. I don't know what it is. L3, whatever that means. Point one. Okay. I like the idea of it being more um, black and white versus the gray that I ended up getting in there. Well, it's different. <laughs> I'm not sure about it, but it is different. Uh, what about some splatters? I do want to do that. Let me... Just because I feel like it needs something, but not anything that screams. Good grief, water. I have to wipe that off. Now, all right, 
there we go. Go play with that. There's so much to play with. Leave things out, add things. You can make these a little shorter if you want. I like them big, I think. But I definitely will be playing some more too. So, y'all go have fun.